Hello everybody, welcome to Market Masterclass and uh, we're doing investment asset types and uh, this one is alternatives. We've done, we've covered already in other sessions, stocks, bonds, cash equivalents, commodities, options, annuities, forex, real estate. Now the alternatives. Alternatives really means that when those ones I've just mentioned don't quite fit the bill, um, corporations, investment companies want to get some money through alternatives. And these are quite lightly regulated. Normally it's big institutional investors or it can be accredited very high net worth individuals who are in this alternatives market. It's complex and as I say there are limited regulations so it gives them a sort of a, a sort of buddy buddy type uh, way of getting money outside the highly regulated areas that we've just mentioned. Uh, it includes it's all to do with collectibles, it includes private equity, it includes hedge funds, managed futures, real estate it can be, it can be commodities, it can be derivatives, but all in a sort of a side room decision about how they're going to regulate it and how, what money they're going to borrow. As I say, high net worth individuals and big institutional investors. Just to give you a sample, the sort of results that alternatives have done. One area of alternatives, particularly popular, is the ETF market, which is exchange traded funds. Now, since June 2016, real estate ETFs, over five years annualized, have returned over 9%. S&P index ETFs, that's just following the S&P index only, has returned over five years an annualized return of over 11%. But just to put you in the picture, if you'd been in certain commodity ETFs over that same period, you would have lost over 21% of your money. So it's all a question, that's why it's the big institutions looking for secure investments and accredited uh, individual investors with a minimum $100,000 to invest. They're the alternatives and there, that's the alternative market. So that's alternatives for today. Thank you for listening. I hope you found that useful. And uh, see you next time. Thank you very much. Bye for now.